Hi guys, let's take a spin around the Gibson course in Cadets. This is a course in London. It's uh, right now early February and dark, so it's cold. Cold is great for your engine, but lousy for your tires, so it's going to be a little bit on the slippery side. I'm going to push my sensitivity all the way to the top, but you'll want to adjust yours to fit your driving style and the device you're using. Pick a setting that will allow you to be smooth yet accurate. This is a screen where typically live racers would join. Uh, there are no live racers available right now, so I'm going to go ahead and hit the Race Now button and we'll get started. You can see the starting grid, we're going to be third, which means we're going to have to pass some people at the start. That's not a problem. Uh, we'll show you how to get around them on the outside here at Gibson. Typically all these races will start with a flyby of the course. It's an opportunity to look over the course. You could just see the O2 in the background there. Uh, if you want, you can hit the skip button when you get here. Uh, for this one, I'm just going to let it run so you get a good look at Gibson. Gibson's a course you'll encounter quite a bit, both in a short and long version. This is the short version. Okay, so when you see the carts, we're about ready to go. Okay, we wait for the light to turn green, and we're off. Slide to the outside, and you're going to pass these guys on the outside. Smooth, stay on the gas, and to the outside, get around them. They've turned a little too quick, so they're a little slower, and you can pass them. Gibson's a tough and tricky course. This is a high-speed turn. Hopefully, you don't hit the wall like I did right there. This turn will take almost flat out. This one is much more difficult. It will require a little tiny bit of either lift or brake, depending on the uh, tier you're in. There's a, a left or a right hand turn here that's gentle, but it's going to come up to a pretty hard right hand turn that can be difficult, especially in faster car, uh, carts, because you have a tendency to slide to the outside. You're going to go to a 180 left hand. Get over to the right side to give yourself the maximum amount of room, and you swing around. The reason you go wide on those turns is to make the radius as large as possible. 90 degree left hand turn. We're coming back to the start line. Be careful, there's a post. That post is inside the fence. If you hit it, you'll stop dead. In cadets, that turn one can be taken flat out, but in faster carts, you're going to either have to lift or brake. Here's that high speed turn. See if I do a better job here. Yeah, that's a little better. And now we're coming down to this one, which is tricky. You want to just hit the apex if you can, just about like that. Get back on the gas, but not so soon that you go into the fence. It's a nice, gentle right-hand turn, but we're coming up to that tricky one. you got to start the turn a little bit early. Hopefully, you hit the apex. Come right around. Stay fast. Get over to the right-hand side now because there's a left-hand 180. Here's that left-hand 180. That was better done than I did the first time. Now you're coming up to the 90 that goes back to the start line. You can grab a little tiny bit of grass with two wheels on this one. That will make the turn a little more gentle, and we're finished. That's Gibson Short.